Both Oromo and Somali ethnic groups have a long history of trouble, frequently over territory. It's not clear what triggered this latest flare-up, but Prime Minister Haile Mariam Desailing is clearly worried. In recent days, there has been a string of disturbing reports from the central Oromia region of the military shooting dead 16 protesters, of 61 people dying in tit for tat attacks, and that more than 30 of them were killed even as they sought a shelter at a police station. Haile Mariam has branded that a massacre. He says the government is doing everything possible to prevent further violence. But what are his options? Ethiopia's parliament previously has declared a state of emergency nationwide following clash in 2016. That was lived only in August this year. Many question now whether the government will have to revive that crackdown. Group Dara CGTN, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.